Why would that be mad? So we're in the dressing room, and Miss Unorganized Abby realizes she didn't read the rules. When we got here and Gianna turned the music in and got the program, Kendall and Maddie were in the teen division. What? Because it's 12 to 14 here. You know, if you would have just read the rules, you could have figured this out. You could have manipulated the numbers a little bit better. She's 11 years old. She isn't even close to a teen. Neither and is Maddie, Maddie. Barely 12. Why would they be in the teen division? Her birthday's in December, so she would have turned already. Is our group a teen? Yes. If you want the girls to walk into Los Angeles victorious with their heads held high, you want them to walk in as champions. And the likelihood of the girls winning in a teen division because at the bottom of the age group is pretty unlikely. A child never has to dance older than they are. We know the odds are against us, and the fact is, the girls are probably not going to win the group dance this week, being in the teen division. Abby, if you replace one of your older dancers with JoJo, it'll drop it down to junior. Well, if you replace JoJo with one of your teens, the group will be a junior. And, of course, stubborn Abby, she'd rather go in the teen category and lose than go in the junior category with a frozen princess dance where it belongs. If I take Mia out and put JoJo in her spot, it would be junior. Me and Mia would be most of the same stuff. JoJo was already pulled from the group dance because she couldn't handle the choreography. I worked for my place on this team. Just giving her choices. I'm livid that she would be so selfish and so involved in getting her kid ahead that she would take that out on my kid is wrong. Our second overall goes to act number 72, Frozen Together. I tried to help you there, Abby, but you didn't listen.